What's going on guys, just a quick little video today. GoPro announced a new line of GoPro cameras, so I wanted to tell you guys about it and let you know what they announced. So they announced the GoPro Hero 4 Black and Silver Edition, just like they do with the other ones, the uh, Hero 3. Uh, they have the Hero 3 Plus and um, Black and Silver Editions. So what's new? Uh, it's going to be a 4K at um, 30 frames per second on the Hero 4 Black. Hero 4 Black, 4K, 30 frames per second, and 1080p at 120 frames per second. It's also going to have a 12 megapixel camera as well as 30 frames per second burst. And you can still use the Wi-Fi control view and share your pictures. And it is waterproof up to 131 feet. They also announced the Hero 4 Silver. That's going to be $399. The black is $499. Um, so $499 for the black, $399.99 for the silver. Now the Hero 4 Silver, 1080p at 60 frames per second or 720p at 120 frames per second. Also has a 12 megapixel camera, 30 frame per second burst and also that the wireless control view and share and it is also waterproof for up to 131 feet. So what's the difference? $100 in price gets you 4k uh, recording. Is that worth it? There's not that many computers that can handle 4k so really I don't know um, what the point is. I'm not going to get it. Um, and the Hero 4 Silver, that's only a 2 megapixel increase from the one I have. So it's not really that much of a, diff a big deal for me. And I don't have any 4K screens and do not plan on getting one anytime soon as they are expensive. And a lot of computers can't even handle that power. So not going to happen for me. But if you guys are interested, go ahead and pick it up. October 5th is the release date. So we got a couple of days. October 5th, the Hero 4 Black, $499. Hero 4 Silver, $399. They also have Hero 4 Black Surf Edition, $499. Hero 4 Black Music Edition, $499. And the Hero 4 Silver Surf and Music Edition for $399 as well. And of course, they're going to be keeping the Hero 3 Plus and Silver and I believe in Black. I'm not sure. Um, but the specs are the same, of course. They just lowered the price from $399 to $299. The Hero 3 White is now going to be at $199 with the same specs. And they got a new entry level GoPro they announced today. So it makes it simple for people that don't that people that can't afford a four hundred and ninety nine dollar camera but still want to get some of the specs that a GoPro can do, still wanna get in the water with it and make some cool videos on your helmet, riding a bike, something like that. They can still do that for only hundred and twenty nine dollars. It's gonna be ten eighty P with thirty frames per second or seven twenty P at sixty frames per second. It's only going to have a 5 megapixel camera, which isn't too bad, um, but 1080p is really good, and 5 frames per second burst, and it is a, and it is also waterproof up to 131 feet, so that's a good price for entry level if someone wants to pick one up. Um, it looks like it's going to be a gray design, gray color, um, so I'm sure it's going to be the same size, so you can still use all the adapters and stuff, so that's cool that they went and lowered the price for people that can't afford the more expensive models. But yeah, basically the big difference is 4K. Um, so if 4K interests you, if you have a 4K screen, the Hero 4, the GoPro Hero 4 Black and Silver might be for you. Again, $499.99 and $399.99 available on October 5th. It's a couple of days. Let me know what you guys think about this, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.